Buckle up, folks, for a laugh that's faster than a speeding sports car and a blonde that's blonder than a bottle of bleed. In today's cartoon story joke, we've got a Officer O'Malley on a routine patrol who pulled over, wait for it, a gorgeous blonde with a lead foot and a memory like a faulty flip phone. Let's see how this traffic stop goes sideways, faster than a runaway shopping cart. Officer O'Malley, a man whose dating life resembled a tumbleweed in a ghost town, was having a day that could only be described as interesting. He was writing a particularly scathing parking ticket for a pigeon, don't ask, when a cherry red Ferrari screeched past him like a runaway shopping cart full of kittens. O'Malley, heart doing a tap dance in his chest, whipped a U-turn and pulled over the culprit. As he approached the car, his eyes did a double take. Behind the wheel sat a vision, a blonde with hair that would make a highlighter jealous and eyes the color of the Caribbean on a good day. This wasn't your average traffic stop. This was O'Malley facing his kryptonite. Beauty and, well, the distinct possibility this woman might not know the difference between a gas pedal and a brake. I've pulled you over for speeding, ma'am. Can I see your driver's license? Sorry, officer, but what is a driver's license? Officer O'Malley thought to himself, how can a pretty woman be so clueless? I mean, not knowing what a driver's license is. You know the small card, looking like a credit card, it has a photo of you on it and is usually found in your wallet. Officer O'Malley, a man whose patience wore thinner than a disco shirt in the 80s, was starting to tap his foot. The blonde rummaged through her purse like a squirrel searching for the last acorn of autumn, finally unearthing a plastic rectangle that vaguely resembled a driver's license. Here you go. No, ma'am, may I please see your registration? Um, registration? What's that? It's usually in U-Glove compartment. Officer O'Malley, whose patience had already reached the single-ply stage, was starting to suspect this interaction would be filed under learning experiences that make you question your career choice. The blonde, after what seemed like an archaeological dig through her purse, finally produced a crumpled piece of paper. Is this it? She chirped holding it up with the triumphant air of someone who'd discovered a hidden continent made entirely of chocolate. O'Malley, fearing the document might be a grocery list or a crayon drawing of a unicorn, braced himself for the next round of bewilderment. I'll be back in a minute. The officer walked back to his car and called into a dispatcher to run a check on the woman driver's license and registration. After a pregnant pause, the dispatcher came back. Um, is this woman driving a red sports car and a drop-dead gorgeous blonde? Um, yes, how did you know? Well, officer, this woman is known for speeding, and when she is pulled over, she somehow managed to get away without any warning or fine. Ah, uh, I see, I wonder how that happens. No one knows, officer, but here is something you can do. Give her, her stuff back, and drop your pants just like that in front of her. Well, I can't do that. It's inappropriate. The officer was shocked. I mean, he can't do that. Trust me, just do it. The dispatcher on the other end, well, let's just say his name was Dennis, and his idea of a good time involved embarrassing others and questionable dating app profiles. He pictured Officer McHotty fumbling with his pants like a confused penguin trying to put on a tuxedo. A glint lit up Dennis's eyes a glint that could only mean one thing, Operation Hilarious. Traffic stop was a go. The officer returned to the blonde and gave her her license and registration back, and with a big breath in, he dropped his pants. The officer just stood there, pants down and all, and looked at the blonde. The blonde just looked down and said, Oh no, not another breathalyzer. If you liked our joke, then please watch our next joke by clicking here.